This episode of Techno Buffalo is brought to you by lynda.com. What's up, everyone? Welcome back to the episode of Rentinger's Rants. I'm your host, John Rentinger's, the show where I rant and rave on something in the world of technology or somehow peripherally touching or related to the world of technology, like a first cousin of the world of technology. Up this week, I want to talk about you in particular. In previous weeks, I've ranted and raved on how mean the internet is, in particular how mean YouTube comments can be, but you deserve a pat on the back. I think you might be getting nicer. This is Rentinger's Rants. Let's go ahead and get started. The internet is a wonderful place. It's a bastion of learning, a place to share information, to just check out crazy new things, and the best place in the world to see videos of guys getting hit in the balls. And it's also a place where you can get bullied, where people have an outlet to unleash just crazy hatred and vitriol like you would never believe. And I've talked about that in the past, on how it's a really hard thing to do to be a video producer or content producer, to have to deal with that content, to have to deal with those negativity, and have to find a way to force yourself through it, have your skin get thicker and thicker and thicker without it chipping away from you. And for me personally, it's been really hard to do that. It was really hard in the first couple of years as I did this. I'm a pretty sensitive guy, if you didn't know, sort of hearing all these awful things like, Android is the best, you're an awful human being, and you and your family should rot in a horrible, horrible pit of death and despair. Crazy things that you wouldn't expect a normal human being to say to another human being. And we've talked about it. And now I can kind of say that I think YouTube is getting a little bit nicer, at least on our videos. Things seem to be getting a little bit more civil. Baby steps. I'm not saying everybody's super nice and we're living in rainbow land with unicorn farts coming out of the sky. I'm talking a little more common decency is being shown in YouTube comments. And I kind of appreciate it. So I put up a video a while back talking about my updated thoughts on the Microsoft Surface Pro and Windows 8 as a whole. To summarize that video, I kind of changed my mind. I kept using the Surface Pro because my home computer wasn't working. And I really realized after a while of using it, I liked it. And I liked Windows 8. My opinions that I had initially didn't really hold up anymore. So I did an updated video. I figured I've got the right to change my mind. So people were commenting, oh, you know, nice things for doing that. And there was the obvious stuff of, oh, how much did Microsoft pay you? Or Windows sucks, you should go kill yourself kind of things. And I'm noticing that all those negative comments are getting voted down and marked as spam. They're not even showing up anymore. I'm trying to see that happen more and more and more in our videos. Sometimes I'll go in and I'll reply to the trolls. And I know I shouldn't. The more I do this, the thicker my skin gets. But eventually you can nick it. You can get in there. And I get upset, especially when someone questions my integrity. Like how much did someone pay you to change your mind? I mean, I don't think that awfully illegal. Um, it's also super unethical. Uh, I consider myself to be a pretty ethical person. Um, if anything is sponsored, we obviously have to disclose all that. We do sponsor content, but we always tell the audience it would never masquerade a video um, as something that it wasn't and something that, you know, I get called out on something like that or threatened or something like that. It really uh, gets me. I don't know why. Maybe because I try so hard to sort of operate a company um, at, a, at a high level uh, of ethics. And I don't know, just it always gets me and things like that. I always reply to it. It's nice to see the internet being like, hey, you are wrong, person. So I just want to pat you on the back. YouTube isn't really a, necessarily a rant, more of a thank you and a hey, nice work. I've ranted about this in the past. So YouTube, nice work to you. Keep it up. Let me take a minute to thank our friends and sponsors at lynda.com. You can learn it at lynda.com. It's an online learning company with more than 77,000 video tutorials that teach software, creative and business skills, and all kinds of other stuff you need to learn to be successful in this grand world. Membership starts just 25 bucks per month, provides unlimited 24 seven access to top quality courses, top expert instructors with real world experience. So none of this people masquerading like know what they're talking about. You can learn on the go with their optimized mobile site or free iPhone or iPad apps for members. Try lynda.com for free for seven days by visiting lynda.com slash technobuffalo. Until next week, I am John Renter from Techno Buffalo, and I'll be ranting about something kind of interesting. I'll see you guys then. What's up guys, it's John again. Just wanted to let you know that if you liked what you saw, I hope you did, we've got two other shows that go live every single week. Come rain, shine, sleet, or snow. Ask the Buffalo, where Ashley Escada answers your tech questions and a rumor roundup where yours truly tells you about all the best rumors in the gadget world. Click the text below that says subscribe and check out our other shows by clicking right over here. Till next video, thanks for watching.